today we're at Jeffrey Mansion in Bexley, Ohio. Construction is almost complete for the walkway which stretches from the street back to the house. Built as a single family home in 1905 by industrialist Robert H. Jeffrey and his wife Mary, Jeffrey Mansion and its surrounding 32 acres were donated to the city of Bexley in 1941. As you walk to the back of the house, you'll notice the beautiful stone walls and walkways. Plenty of space in the back to throw a football, have a soccer match, and behind the tree line is the Elm Creek River. Today, the historic building offers city recreation, sports, swimming pool and tennis courts, cultural and art education programs, and provides special event facilities for the community. Great play area for the kids. As you walk in, this would have been their entranceway. The great room. The dining room with fireplace looking into the great room. The dining room with the door to the pantry. Now we're going to head up to the third floor first. Back in the 1920s, the third floor housed the servant quarters. As you enter the third floor, this would have been part of the great room, which also extends behind you. As you go through the doorway, which you can see has changed, this was one of the three bedrooms that occupied the third floor. Now down these doors and up the next is the tower. And in the tower, it's approximately eight feet by eight feet. It is extremely small. And there are three windows in that room. Beautiful view out into the front of the yard and the side.
Now heading back through that door, you would be on the third floor, servant quarters, great room. Back down the stairs to the second floor, this would have been the bedroom area of the house. Currently, it's occupied by preschoolers and unfortunately I could not get in to see most of the rooms due to the fact there were many children there. These next two slides are the back stairs which the servants from the third floor would work their way down to the kitchen on the first floor. The view from the kitchen to the backyard. The pantry area. Unfortunately, I was unable to get any pictures in the basement, but downstairs below, it used to be a shooting range. For those counting, it was a three-car garage. Thanks for watching and have a great day.